Hello, friends, and welcome to the Magic Man Mo Monday Show. Hello, friends. It's me. It me, Magic Man Mo. Welcome back. Hey, it's been a little while. I think I skipped last week. I skipped last week's Monday Monday Show uh, just because I didn't record one. That's the only reason. It's not a good reason. It's just the one I have. Last week, I asked you guys in two polls, because I forgot to put a poll on Twitter. I asked you in two polls, one on my community tab over on YouTube and one in, on my Discord, about what you guys thought about my uniform, about my outfit, about what I wear in episodes. And what you guys said uh, over on YouTube and Discord is pretty much uh, wear whatever I want. Wear whatever I want. You guys voted for wear whatever I want. Uh, on Discord, somehow, there was a, a fourth option. I don't know, I don't know how you guys did that. <laughs> I only gave you three, and you guys somehow came up with four. Don't know how you pulled that off, but uh, you guys came up with wear whatever you want. So I've been wearing whatever I want. Sometimes I wear this, sometimes I wear other stuff. A couple of you voted for doing the like, come up with a new outfit entirely, and I haven't come up with a good idea for that just yet. So I've just been doing whatever, and I'm really glad you guys support me wearing anything that you don't mind that I change it up and shake it up every now and again i appreciate that so thank you for those of you that voted and if you didn't get to vote and you missed that memo somehow don't worry about it it's all right something that i haven't done in a while that i thought i might do in this show is go ahead and read some of your recent comments because i thought some of them were interesting and worth reading and that i should probably put out there in a video or say anyway so i'm going to do a little bit of comment reading i want to start with some of the comments from uh, the last magic men mo monday show starting with we have the flaming red x gamer a, a, a a uh, 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 not an, uh, an often commenter. That's not that's not a word. A frequent, a frequent commenter here on the channel saying 1.3k. Congrats! Yes, you're right. We did. We hit one uh, what one one thousand three hundred subscribers earlier in February, a couple of weeks ago. I know I didn't do any pomp or circumstance or a specific video about it. I probably should have, and I I, I remember kind of thinking about doing that, and I never got around to it. Sorry about that. But we did get to that. Thank you guys so much for the uh, continued su uh, support. I should have done something for it. Maybe maybe at 1,400. And of course, absolutely at 1,500. Because that seems like a... Like, sets of 500 feel more like... Like like actual milestones, but but we'll we'll try to do something again uh, at 14. Nothing big, but just uh, some acknowledgement of that. But thank you so much uh, for the congratulations. Also from the flaming Red X gamer saying one of your stickers should be your old animated logo. I think that's a great idea, actually. Either a badge or an emoji. I haven't decided what. If you're watching this right now, chances are I haven't updated the badges and emojis available. If you become a member on the channel that's that join button down below i haven't updated those just yet because i haven't had them made yet but that'll be coming soon but that's a good point probably I'll, i might do that for uh some emojis some of the old animated logos um they weren't animated but like drawn like like cartoony looking uh logos i can think of like two off the top of my head that i could probably do so uh, yeah that's a really good idea i'll probably Make that available, if not by the time you're seeing this, soon. So long as, because they have to be a certain size, so so long as I can shrink it down to that size without it looking too garbled, I'll test it out and see what it is. That's a really good idea, Flaming Red X Gamer. I really like this comment from Grassland Herbivore. Mo knows how to show. I try. I try to know how to show. This comment comes from Mikey, saying, who are you talking to? Is Mike real? Uh, that was when I was doing, like, throughout the episode, like, talking to this person off screen called Mike. No, that was just a gag I was doing. It's it's a way of like having a conversation with a person, but the conversation is actually kind of secretly with the audience. It's it's a it's dumb. It was just it, it was a joke. Mike Mike's not real. I think I did that on a previous Magic Man Monday show with a like a Steve or something. I don't remember what it was. In fact, I was thinking about opening this episode talking to just some random person named Dave, but I decided not to do that. No, Mike's not a real person. There's no Mike. Trust me, it's just a one-man show. I'm the only one behind this camera. Mikey also comments, hashtag bring the hat. I think maybe, does that does that make, mean you're you're a bigger fan of, of Magic Man Mo with the hat? I'll get the hat. See, Mike, this is the hat that Mikey's talking about. Yeah, you, you guys kind of share a name, but, but you're Mike and he's Mikey. And Mikey says, yeah, I should hashtag bring the hat. So I guess I'm going to bring the hat. There we go. It's like class. It's a classic magic man. Well, not really 
not not really classic. Classic Magic Man Mo is. Ooh, we don't we don't talk about classic Magic Man Mo. <laughs> God. This comment also from the Flaming Red X Gamer. Uh, he says, one, I forgot to talk about the new Somniferous merch. It's not really new at this point anymore, and I, I didn't talk about it, but that is kind of because the last Magic Man Monday show was kind of a giant ad for the... Uh, uh, for the membership program and the uh, the humble bundle thing, and I didn't want it. I didn't want to be too spammy with just ads, like like give me money, give me money. I didn't want to be like that. But there is new somniferous merch. It's a reference to the Inca Games games that we uh, uh, pl have played so many times on the channel. That series, how somniferous is so uh, prevalent in the in the game. So I made some somniferous merch. If that's something that interests you, you can absolutely check it out in that i card. Uh, or in the link in the description down below to check out my merchandise. I've got other stuff there as well, including the somniferous stuff. And then you said, too, the wash your hands comes from the Chavo and the Giant Sandwich, which I haven't gone back and rewatched that episode, and I don't know if that's a, a joke that they make on the show, but to my knowledge, I just made up. I just started saying wash your hands at the end of my videos uh, for giggles. I, I think it's, it's important to me. I didn't steal that from anybody. I just started using it. If other people have used it before me, then I believe you. Uh, and I don't know what the first when the first time I ever started doing that was. It might have been Chavo and the Giant Sh Sandwich. I don't remember. Uh, but yeah, to my knowledge, I just started doing that for no reason. And this this comment actually comes from a different video. But uh, Red X Gamer commented on the uh, third episode of Looney Tunes: World of Mayhem, and he he said, "Finally, I love this series. Please make more." But P.S. Please don't membership stream this game because I really want to see this game in episodes. I don't have any money and I really love this game, so please don't membership stream it. So I don't plan on streaming any mobile games because I don't really have the technology to do so, or at least not in the way I would like to do so. So I'm not too worried about streaming the game, but in terms of playing the game, I will not lock behind because I mentioned I'm going to do membership streams. I, sh I should I should give you guys some information about what he's what what. Uh, uh, Red X is talking about. I mentioned that in the if you become a member of the channel, I will host uh, membership only streams. I will not lock behind a membership stream any ongoing series that I already currently have available for free. So, like if I've got a let's play or a playthrough of something that's already going on, like the Looney Tunes World of Mayhem or any other, like, or like Yakuza, not that a lot of people are watching that series anyway, but, or if it's an Inca game playthrough or if it's a, a, a Carmel game playthrough, a full playthrough of a game that I've already started not in the membership streams, I won't lock behind membership streams. So you don't have to worry about that stuff. And membership streams are bonus content only. They're standalone content only. It's just for just an extra little peek for people that decide to throw me a little extra cash to help support the show. But I don't want anyone to feel left out of any ongoing series. So I won't do that. But that was an excellent point. That was an excellent question. I won't do that. Thank you for bringing that up. This next comment also comes from the Flaming Red X Gamer uh, who says, for my next MMMMS, did I say uh, did I say M too many times? M M M M S. Magic Man Mo Monday Show. You should show your Steam library. Sure, why not? This is almost kind of embarrassing. It, all my stuff. So, oh, oh, hopefully, there's nothing on screen that's like, you know, no sensitive information. I don't think so. It's almost embarrassing, actually, how many uh, games I have. I have a huge Steam library, and I've gotten the the vast majority of my games on sales and Humble Bundles, specifically sales through Humble Bundle. By the way, I keep mentioning Humble Bundle. I love Humble Bundle so much. If you would like to sign up for the Humble Bundle monthly uh, uh, thing, monthly bundle program thing, or you'd like to buy games through Humble Bundle, I do have a link down in the description that you can check out uh, to sign up for the monthly thing. Uh, if you do make a purchase using that link, you'll be supporting the show, blah, blah, blah. I've talked about this last episode. I don't want to go into that too much, but I've gotten... What, the reason I bring that up is because I've bought most of my games through Humble Bundle, and I have a huge library. If I hover over my library here, I have 324 games in my Steam library, and I'm not anywhere close to having played any of them. I also have some random software. The VR is not a game. That's just like the VR setup. I don't have a VR setup, uh, but... Here's all my games. I, I, I've got only three games in my favorites menu. Uh, I had a, I had more, but I was cleaning it up. But I've got 
you know, Sid Meier's Civilization 5, 6, and Stellaris. I love these games. These are games I uh, download and load up and play uh, every now and again. They're favorites of mine. But then I've got a whole slew of other games. As you can see, you'll probably have to stop the video and look at it yourself. Because I'm not going to actually go through and read all of them because it's insane how many I actually own. A lot of them, like, I have, like, almost every single Tomb Raider. I, like, the newest one I don't have. Has there been one or two games that I don't have? But that, that's just an example. So some of them are series. That's why I have so many. Um, Who's the Zero is all the way down here at the bottom, right above YouTubers Live. <laughs> we did a YouTubers Live stream once. So it was not particularly successful. Going back to the top, there's 11th Hour, a classic one I've played. 140 I've played. I've Have I played the 39 Steps? I don't think I did. Did I play the 39 Steps? I don't remember what that is. I've played the 7th Guest. A, uh, I haven't done Ace's Wild. There's a lot of games. I played uh, an episode of Blind Date. I did a stream of... Did I do a stream or an episode? No, I did a video of Brawlhalla. Uh, City Skylines is a game that I played for a little while, but I haven't done it on the show before, but I still have it downloaded and installed. Elder Scrolls, I did some uh, uh, Skyrim uh, stream a while back. Kenshi's a game that I've been playing quite a bit of lately. It's... I don't, I don't know if it's good for streaming or playing a, an act, doing an actual episode for, but it's a, it's a game that's right up my alley. It's a giant sandbox. There's really no story, but you just kind of like... Uh, you suck. Basically, you're given a character that sucks at everything, and you can die super easy, and you try to struggle your way through and create a squad and maybe start a base and that sort of thing. It's a very, very hard game. Uh, it's got a very high learning curve. Nightmare House 2, I don't actually have it installed, but it says it's installed because it's weird. I've never been able to get it not installed, but that was a video that I did a couple of years ago for Halloween, and it still thinks it's installed. I, I've got Spy Fox and Cheese Jason to hold the mustard installed right now because I was going to make videos for those. They're very small files. That's why they're still installed and I never uninstalled them. Uh, I was going to make videos for those like a year or two ago when I was doing all those humongous games games on the channel and I never got around to it. So they're still there. Uh, but yeah, I've got loads of games. Like I said, over 300 here. I've got so many. I want to come up with a way. It's probably possible, but I haven't figured it out because uh, I haven't sat down to try to figure it out. Is I, I, I want to make my library available publicly somehow so that you guys can see what I have, so that you know what to suggest that I play next, what you know, what interests you, and that sort of thing. And I want to make a wish list available so that you know what I'm interested in getting. Not necessarily so that you can buy it for me, but if you do, I won't say no. <laughs> but, but, but just so that you know what I'm interested in, what kind of games I like. And if you're like, oh, that would be really good for the channel, you should buy that one, Magic Manmo. And I'll be like, oh, if you're interested in it and I'm interested in it, maybe I'll get it. That sort of thing. Or if it goes on sale or whatever. So I want to make my library available, maybe work on some kind of wish list thing, just so you can see what I'm interested in and that sort of thing. I haven't sat down to do it. Let me know if you think that's a good idea, and maybe I'll try to make that happen soon. I don't want to go over this too many times. Uh, th there were a few. I haven't seen all of them, but like, uh, there's been a few comments like from Hermando de Koning and uh, Fuzi. Hermando said, nice video again, and Fuzi said, man, this channel's underrated. Great video, dude. I really appreciate comments like those. Uh, they make me feel good. I I'm glad you guys enjoy the videos that I make, and I, 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 throughout, in the past, I've received similar comments, though, you know, you should, you deserve more subscribers and that sort of thing. And really, that's ultimately always up to you guys. It's, it's up to you guys. I already share my videos as much as I possibly can. I make them. I try to promote them as much as I can, but that's up to you guys. It's all up to you. If you believe that I deserve more subscribers, it's up to you to help, to help. That's, that's, but, but I really, I really appreciate your guys' support and saying those things, uh, especially when sometimes I, I feel down and I wonder whether or not my videos are any good. I'm like, how, how am I doing? How's this channel running? And it's like, is this the right path? Or am, I, am I playing the right games? Are people interested in this kind of thing? When I'm having moments of doubt about where I, what direction to take and what I'm doing, comments like those make me feel pretty good. So I appreciate that. Thank you guys for the comments. Oh, there's another one by Faz. You deserve way more subs. Keep it up. Thumbs up. What's this one? Read more. You should also make more Myth of Soma videos. I haven't made any Myth of Soma. Myth of Soma was a sponsored series I did, God, two years ago or so? I don't, they, I don't know how you, Faz, I don't know how you randomly discovered my Myth of Soma series, but well, welcome to the channel. Again, the whole deserve more subs. I appreciate that. I don't know if you guys are saying that to be nice, but I appreciate it. That's all the comments that I've got to read. Uh, this time, a lot. there's a lot of them that I, I've got more comments, obviously, but that's where I'm going to stop there. I'm going to award the... The, the the commenter of the week award to flaming red x gamer blah, for uh being the person who suggested and asked me and, and, and stuff the the most 
ish and had very relevant comments. So congratulations, Flaming Red X Gamer. You're our commenter of the week. This is a new thing. Is it going to become a weekly thing? Tune in next week to find out. <laughs> I thought that would be pretty fun. I thought that'd be pretty fun to actually do a read comments. I haven't done a read, read comments on the channel in a while. I was doing... Uh, reading comments and Q&As and stuff like that long time ago for like 100 subscriber milestones or whatever. It's kind of nice to go back to this. Speaking of Q&As, if you guys have questions that you'd like me to answer in a Q&A video, leave them down in the comments down below. Maybe I'll make a Q&A video or not. That's completely up to you guys, obviously. <laughs> but uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is where I'm going to stop this week's Magic Man Mo Monday show. Do you have an idea about what I should do in the next one? Leave that down below as well. If you enjoyed this video, please do all the things. Hit that like button on this video. And if you've got some time today, go into my, my in my videos playlist and like every single video ever that's your that's your homework it's your homework now i want you to go like all my video all of them all how many videos do i have now like 1300 how, hang, video manager hang on, we're gonna check this out 1431 videos i don't know if that includes all the private ones or not but your your mission is to go like a thousand videos t t today and if and if if 20 of you watch this video, then I should have 20,000 new likes. <laughs> Obviously, don't do that. Don't waste your time. I'm just kidding. Don't bother. But uh, again, I want to thank all of you so much for watching this. If you enjoyed it, please do all the things. But whatever you guys do, I want to thank you all so much for watching. And until next time, wash your hands. I'm, I'm not going to I'm not gonna make this a thing. I'm not going to do this at the end of every episode. Don't worry. It's kind of weird. I should have just ended the episode right now.